September 27th, 2020 is when it happened. And I was like, we gotta get out, bro. Cause like, we thought it was so funny for about three hours. We thought she was joking for the longest time. And then we figured out it was real. Going to see haunted stuff, I was like, F you ghost. Still remember the night. I was driving and everyone practically yelled at me to pull over. She didn't remember anything. It's pretty terrifying. When you have one of your closest friends go through a traumatic life altering event right in front of you and five others, and you have to be the one to step up and save your friend, it impacts you in ways you could not ever begin to explain. When I was young, naive, and into worldly stuff, I was not religious at all. I played demonic games, rituals, I was all into horoscopes, tarot cards, Ouija boards, although I never touched one, and I was huge on exploring haunted locations. My whole YouTube channel is basically paranormal stuff. I brought in so many people to do collaborations with, for content and clout, without even realizing what I was doing to them, with negative demonic attachments. I really feel like my past of doing all of those things is what brought us to this experience happening. It was reckoned to happen sooner or later. Oh. Will this always be a night that you'll remember? Oh yeah, definitely. And then shit gets real. And this is the part where it changed all of our lives. 